hello everyone uh, in this video I am going to start a fresh uh, first uh, program in Golang so I have created a Golang uh, IDE and uh, I am creating a new project there just clicking on the new project and uh, I will give uh, the path so it's in my this hierarchy and I will create a new folder there just provide a go lang rest api and create a folder and i will select that and press ok and then click on the create so uh, the project is created here if you can uh, see there is a go mod uh, which is uh, a configuration file uh, in the f first line it's a module uh, which is the name of the project and the second is uh, a go version so if in future we need to install any dependency it will be uh, comes over there so first of all I will create a new uh, go file I will call it main.go and uh, for the main program we will use a main package not the one which inside the folder so first I will type function and it could be main function and in that I will for printing anything in Golang we will use FMT uh, for printing uh, anything on the console we will use FMT in Golang so here when I have typed fmt.println it will automatically import the FMT package uh, so we will use its functions println so it's a, a Golang IDE which gives us a feature uh, for auto importing if uh, you are using some other IDEs you will need to import that uh, import FMT by manual so here I will just type in welcome to Golang REST API with fiber framework course so I will you save it and on the next how uh, we will run that so in my terminal I will click on that uh, in your case if you are using command line or any other terminal just go to the directory root directory of your project like I, I am in the golang rest API so just type over there go run main.go and press enter here it will prompt you to the uh, welcome message to the console so that's the first program of the Golang and uh, I will uh, get started uh, in the REST API course from the next video so thank you so much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe our channel